Welcome to this video tutorial for Stock Investor Pro, AII's fundamental stock screening and research database program. In this video segment, we will discuss measuring performance with relative strength. The performance of a stock is typically measured on an absolute or a relative basis. Price change over a specific time period is an example of absolute performance, while relative performance communicates how well a stock has performed compared to some benchmark, usually the market or an index. In Stock Investor Pro, relative strength index fields compare a stock's performance to that of the S&P 500 index. As you can see here, I'm going to enter the Microsoft ticker symbol in the ticker search box. Once a company is highlighted in Stock Investor Pro, all of the data contained in the tabs at the top will be for that corresponding company. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Overview and then click on Share Statistics. Here I will find the relative strength data provided. As you can see, there is relative strength figures for 4-week, 13-week, 26-week, and 52-week. There's also a percent change for each of those corresponding time periods. In the case of Microsoft, we can see that the relative strength for uh, the last 4-week period is negative 3.11, which means that Microsoft has performed 3.11% worse than the S&P 500 over that time frame. Relative strength can help you in deciding between two stocks. For example, these are the relative strength figures for Hewlett Packard. As you can see, the relative strength figures in the longer term has been very weak, but the company has seen some price appreciation during the last four months. Here are the relative strength figures for Dell. As you can see, the company is weak as well. However, the company has been able to maintain stronger relative strength through all the periods when compared to Hewlett Packard. In addition, Stock Investor Pro also provides percentile ranks for relative strength. Percentile rank shows you how a company compares to all the companies in the database. Percentile rank fields are useful in comparing a company's results in a certain area against that of the entire universe. Dell's percentile rank of 89 means that it has performed better than 89% of the companies in the entire database over a four-week period. The program also allows you to screen using percentile rank. The percentile rank function for relative strength is found in the percent rank category. If you expand this and scroll down, you'll see percent rank dash relative strength for each time period. Here I'm going to screen for companies with 52 relative strengths in the top 95th percentile. In the operator, I use greater than or equal to, which means that companies in the 95th percentile will also be included in this screen. Between 5 and 6% of the companies in the database are passing. These are the companies that have performed the best when compared to the S&P 500 over the last year. Percent ranks are not given for every data point. To see which data points have percent ranks, go to the Help menu and search for the data point that you want. Here I'm going to search for relative strength. When I find the data points, I simply double click on it. On the description in the right hand side, you'll see whether a percent rank comes with the data point or not. When interpreting relative strength, remember that even a stock that is rapidly rising in price may have weak relative strength if the market is ra rising more rapidly than the stock. Of course, the opposite is also true. For more information on Stock Investor Pro, please visit our website or our wiki. As always, feel free to email us or give us a call.